Alright, so today, you guys, I'm doing another costume review video. So, like I told y'all the last video about the emblem, basically the, um, our version of the reverse flash emblem, I had finally spray painted the, uh, emblem that we were going to use, and now we're going to add the little yellow sort of plate in the bottom. So, that's what we're going to do, and then with this, I don't know. If we're gonna use this for my the torso of my character but I will actually be able to spray paint this yellow if I get some yellow spray paint but here is <clears throat> the emblem right here so I spray painted the other day and um, this is how it turned out it's really cool how I spray paint but I have to still go like if you see here back and spray paint a little bit more so I can be able to get the full red color in it but for right now it, it looks really nice I didn't want to spray paint the back but it looks like when it was dripping it went it ran through the back but it's okay but what we're gonna do is we're gonna add the little yellow plate to it so then you can see the emblem very clearly so yeah um so the emblem is created so that's what's gonna happen but I didn't want to spray paint this red because I didn't know what we we're gonna do with this emblem yet but yeah so these are the emblems then plus the other day I had 3d printed out the Robin emblem for the injustice video but it turned out too big but here it is but it turned out too big but what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna actually get a smaller version and paint it and show it to you guys so I can finally be able to create the Robin outfit for my brother for the Injustice video. So here is the Robin emblem, the 3D printed Robin emblem. Um, so it looked it looks really cool, and the emblem looks the exact same thing from the Injustice one. The thing is, it's too big. So guess. So what I did was I didn't want to throw this away. So I'm keeping it as sort of like a, a stand. So when I get like a Robin action figure, I'm going to paint this hot glue it him onto here and sort of sign it at the bottom by me or something. But I'm not sure just yet, but I'm going to leave it how it is. Or I can maybe use this in the Teen Titan show that's coming up and maybe use this for certain items. Um, but yeah, these are all the stuff here that I have 3D printed out for right now. Plus I have to 3D print out my cosplay um, outfit, helmet, then plus I have to uh, 3D print out some other stuff. And I posted on Instagram that if anybody wants to see the upcoming like casting and stuff of Teen Titans, they will have to at least get up to 12 likes and on the photo that has a Teen Titans emblem and if they get up to 12 likes or more I will post the full cast of the Teen Titans and I will post it on YouTube as well so if I can at least maybe get five likes on this video I will actually be able to post up the casting on YouTube and then if you guys want um, to see the casting for again and more projects that we're working on just go to our instagram page and it'll be down there but yeah that's all I'm all that's all i'm gonna say for now but please make sure to like comment and subscribe and turn on your post notifications so you won't miss a video of us because since the week is over with and i'm on break i'm gonna see if i can finally do the ben 10 video and get that out the way so i can start posting it but when i post the video it's going to be edited by our very own Zakai Morgan. But if not, then I don't know, I'm not sure yet. But yeah. But that's all I'm going to say for now because my phone about to die. But yeah, I'll see you guys next time.